Uh, sorry about that. But, hey everybody, what are you doing about here? And wait a second. Why? It's the most wonderful time of the year. Merry Christmas, Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Holiday to all my fellow viewers and subscribers. I'm sorry I've been so absent of the late of this year, but it's not completely my fault. Uh, I went through a good state of depression, I went through a good state of thinking up new ideas to do and whatnot. And at the moment, I do have an update to give to you guys before we get into the present carnage. Is that I do intend to still use this channel. I'm thinking about doing movie reviews the same way how I did uh, my Wolf Children review, which I uploaded. Yeah, according to when I'm recording this, it was when yesterday, December 22nd. So you guys can go and check that out. But. I don't know how long I'm going to be wearing this, but I'm going to try to keep it on our video, but I will be doing different movie reviews. I'm probably going to take until maybe New Year's Eve off, at least, um, and then after that, I'm just going to kind of go in maybe like a weekly fashion, like a new episode every week of a new series I'm planning on doing calling, and I'm going to call it Lazy Cinema, so I can't wait to show that off to you guys. And that will be coming probably either New Year's Eve or New Year's Day, so be on the lookout for that. So anyways, I have a crap ton to get through. Um, I'm just going to start with what's behind me, and then I'm just going to work on my way with it. At first, I have a puppy calendar. Puppy puppies. And uh, on the back, you guys can see like some of the puppies that we have on there. My favorite down here, the Welch Corgi. Cute. Speaking of dogs, I have pajama bottoms for my older sister. Uh, this will work with my uh, Corgi shirt that I have um, in my dresser that you guys have seen me wear in other videos that I got a couple of years ago, I believe. Not last year. <clears throat> so, to, you know, this year was better because we had everybody over. Now I have, this is Halloween. I am Jack. The Pumpkin King. That's right. I am the Pumpkin King. Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, sweatpants, and also we'll get to it. It's a blanket. Next up, I have some Yu-Gi-Oh items from my sister and her uh, lovely boyfriend. So thank you very much for this. Uh, this is a, a Yu-Gi-Oh card. Um, Swiper, Abwet, and Raw game mat. This is an actual game mat that you can use to play the game on. I, however, probably won't be using this as a game mat, um, and I will show you why in just a bit. I plan on using it for a display item, but we'll get into that momentarily. So again, that is the um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Abwet, the Tormentor, Twice for the Sky Dragon, and uh, Ra, the Wing Dragon of Ra. Next up, I have a Hot Wheels, and I call it the, so I'm pretty famous for this. It is a... Batmobile from the new Batman movie coming out next year, I believe, which I'm very excited for. Up oh, next, from my oldest sister and a boyfriend both, this is a Pokemon Throw Blanket. I would put it on, but I'm pretty warm as it is right now. But I would just pull it out of the sleeve. Maybe I can show it off. Because my sister knows that I wear Bulbasaur, so this also has Bulbasaur on it, so, um... There you go. Now I gotta wash it first. Um, <laughs> no, I'm just gonna put that over there. So that was cute. Uh, here we have a Spider-Man. Uh, this is a Spider-Man ornament. My sister got it for me after we saw um, No Way Home. And I'm gonna think that she's gonna get me one more. So then technically on my Christmas tree, I can have Toby, Andrew, and, uh, Tom. All together. Who knows? Um, this is an uh, obvious joke for this. Um, in my family, whenever that we watch uh, Santa Claus is Coming to Town, I always make the reference about the yo-yo from Burger Mike to Mike to Burger. So, my older sister thought it would be cute to get me a light-up yo-yo, and I gotta say, it's even cuter that it is Baby Yoda. I fell in love with Baby Yoda ever since I saw the Mandalorian trailer. I think the whole world did it by that point. There's a card. Uh, we got some t-shirts to go through. This is a 
I guess it's an Illuminati, um, but it also looks like, like one of those tarot cards, and it just says, the light. so I'm definitely going to be wearing this. It's an extra large, but I don't care, um, because I wear extra large or large t-shirts, so just to let you guys know. Up next, I have one that I picked up for myself. This is from the Avengers video game. And I love my girl Kamala on there. If you guys don't know, Kamala is my favorite um, female superhero one next to uh, Gwen Stacy's Spider one. So, you know. And also, because of the new movie, I got Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. Almost very comic book y. Um, the artwork looks very familiar to me. I want to say that this is John Byrne, but I am not 100% certain, but it, but it looks like John Byrne's artwork. Next up, I got from the thrift store, this is Call of Duty World War II. I might wear this a few times, you know. So there's that. Next up, because of Falcon and Winter Soldier, I have this Sam Wilson as Falcon. Proud to um, introduce him into the world. And then for my sister's boyfriend, who I uh, do love this gift. I think it's an extra large, isn't it? Yeah, but I don't care. This is a Mandalorian t-shirt. I've never seen the Mandalorian. I've always wanted to, though. Um, so that's pretty cool. I gotta, you gotta love that. And before I get to the DVDs, I have socks. Every man needs a pair of socks. You know what I'm saying, people. And also, this is a uh, Nightmare Before... Christmas blanket, just let me unwrap this. So, uh, how are you guys Christmas is going? Let me know in the comments below. Is it going good? Is it going bad? Um, I hope that you all have a good, you know, year. Take. Is it cool? Am I cool enough? Can I join the cool kids now, Mom? Probably not. It's so fluffy, though. So fluffy. <clears throat> Alright. I don't know if I'm ever going to sleep with it. It's very fluffy. It's very, like, soft. Alright, so we have a lot of DVDs to get through before the finale. I have two Yu-Gi-Oh! card backs. Of the same variety. This is the uh, Cyber Strike deck. So, uh... Yeah. I guess I can, uh... So that's pretty cool. Um, at some point, I'm a good doer. So here I have uh, Rocket Man by Taron Egerton. Um, my sister says it's a very good film. I have not yet to see it yet, so maybe possible movie review. You guys want it, should let me know if you want me to see it either by liking the video or telling me down below. And also subscribing. Here I have Gemini Man with Will Smith vs. Will Smith. There's not enough Will Smith enough in this movie, is there? And also, the probably first new movie I'm going to review next year is Godzilla vs. Khan, and it comes with a bonus disc of special features, including 10 feature arts, um, include over an hour of excitement, including the phenomenon of Godzilla Kingdom on Duty, the evolution of King Khan, uh, the battle at sea, and one will fall. So this will be awesome. I've been wanting to see this movie since they talked about it. I was a huge supporter of the movie. Next up, I do have some old um, fashion love in here. I'm just going to put them all together. Now, I'm a big fan of the old DC superhero film uh, TV show, so it's no matter that I got both Batman Beyond and Superman, the animated series. Um, very good gifts, in my opinion. Uh, now, if you guys want to see me do a review of these, I'm not against it, but it would take me, like, a very long time to complete. Um, I might have to show off my DVD collection to you guys before I do my uh, new movie review, just so you guys can get a look at like what I have on my shelf. <clears throat> and also, because I'm a big fan of it, I have the old two uh, volumes of the Wave Master series. I am a huge fan of these. I love Wave Master. This is Volume One, Volume Two. I'm sorry, Volume One, Volume Two. Next, we have uh, some DC movie love. We have Shazam. I might review it. I have no idea. Suicide Squad. The Suicide Squad. This is a sequel to the original. Uh, we have Justice League. 
I might not review Judge of Lee because a lot of people already have done it. And especially with the um, Snyder Verse movies, I don't think I will. And also, my girlfriend will probably beg me to do a review of this non spoiler. Of course, this is Joker. Um, honey, if you're watching this, I did try to get you a copy of this. I might for our anniversary, just FYI. Um, but every time I went down there, this was going off the shelf. So, believe you me. I'm going to keep mine. <laughs> um, you might end up getting one at some point, but I'm going to keep mine, and it is as much yours as it is mine. So, she's probably looking at her boyfriend right now, wondering why he's wearing a Santa cap. Because it can. That's why. Um, this is actually a funny sign, because I told my sister this. It was a t-shirt I saw at Walmart at one point, and I really wanted to get it. It was a Brian Griffin t-shirt, and it said, I'm allergic to stupid people. And Brittany and my sister knows how um, angry I get with like stupid people. I cannot stand to talk to them because it just you you can't penetrate them. I'm gonna hang this in my room somewhere. <laughs> Maybe like behind my bookshelf or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Now the last gift I have here that I know is this. This is a Yu-Gi-Oh! tin box. Um, when I was at my sister's and her boyfriend's place, because they basically lived together, um, she showed me these, and uh, her and her boyfriend both have a couple of these. Now, inside were Yu-Gi-Oh! pads. I already opened them. But, they also came... I'm not going to go through every single Yu-Gi-Oh! card with you guys, I'm going to be honest, because that would take forever. But, um, inside... The God cards. Holy crap. I cannot tell you, like, in all my years of, of collecting Yu-Gi-Oh, how much I wanted these so badly. And, um, my sister was the one that told me that, um, her boyfriend was going to give me these on Christmas. And so, that's what I was very excited for. Now, my plan is, with these and with that map, is to basically make, like, a little shrine, so to speak. Um... In a way, I'm going to take the mat, I'm going to put it inside of a picture frame, I'm large enough, and then I'm going to put each card, I'm going to take them out of their sleeve, and I'm going to put each card individually next to the God card. And I think it will turn out pretty awesome the way how I envision it. And then it will hang up somewhere in my bedroom. Uh, but, um, noted that if, even if you're a friend, and I'm sorry to say, even if you're my girlfriend, hi honey, uh, love you, thank you for watching. Um, I will murder you if you try to steal these cards. So, so, you, you've been warned. So there's a bunch of cards in here. Um, I do have Karibu. Like, the, one of the Karibu brothers. He gave me another Time Wizard, which is nice of him. I already have my original Time Wizard, but it's in terrible shape. Very terrible shape. I have a limited edition of Cyber and Dragon. That's pretty cool. Where is he? The one I want to get to. I don't know. It's in here somewhere. Oh, God. Because they asked me about it when uh, they gave me it. Oh, God. And they even got me. A red eyes black dragon. I had the limited edition, first edition, but like rare or limited edition of Joey's Red Eye Black Dragon. And I know this is, um, Malefic Red Eye Black Dragon, and you cannot summon without banishing the Red Eyes. It won't be hard for me to try to find or track down uh, a loose Red Eye Black Dragon, but that was awesome. And a bunch of these are like, um, diffusion monsters for, uh, the cyber. So. I got three decks of the same variety. I'm not complaining. I, I, the more powerful my cards can get, and also I have a 
card sleeves. I don't use card sleeves in Yu-Gi-Oh, but that's not a bad thing, I guess. Uh, and so with that, that is all for the Lazy Universe uh, Christmas 2021 special, and I want to say thank you everybody and all for watching. Um, it was a hell of a trip, you know, 2020, when you really think about it, I just want to do real talk for you for a minute. 2020 was a hell of a trip. It was. Think about it. I mean, it was, it was hell. It was. Everything that we went through and everything was hell. I will link my original, um, Christmas special, uh, the last year one in this video. Um, but it was hell. I'm not going to lie to you guys, it was hell, we, we all can agree on that, but we did it together, so that's what makes it count. Uh, so next year I will be doing my new re movie review series, and I'm going to call it Lazy Cinema, and I hope, I, I hope, hope, yeah, I hope, no, I hope I can have, um, you know, a lot of good comeback and whatnot for, for that. It will be happening next year, but before I do that, um, if you guys want me to, I mean, either like enough, maybe get like, I'm not greedy, but like maybe 10 likes, maybe, I don't know, um, but enough to let me know if you guys want me to do my entire DVD collection after I put all these in there, which I do have to now clean up my mess and watch everything and, yeah, fun, isn't it? Uh, but you know, 2020 was hell, but you know, getting to where we are now, we did it together. You know, and I hope that you guys all had a good year. I hope that you all are staying healthy. And uh, please, by all means necessary, if you're not yet, please get your vaccine. The more, the better. Please get your boosters. I mean, you know, please. You know, we're all in this together, and the best way that you can help everyone out is protecting yourself for everyone else. So best way to help everyone out so we had quite a year i had quite a year myself going through depression abuse and doing an abusive situation i just got abused uh, a lot tonight by my own grandmother which you guys have saw the post on twitter um it's pretty hard you know coming a away from that and especially since she does it mostly every day it's pretty hard you know to get across but you know you gotta do what you gotta do you know right <laughs> So, uh, I got a mess to clean up. I hope you guys all Merry Christmas, have a safe Christmas, you know, party safely, drink safely, of course, you know, all have a good time. Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Hanukkah, Merry Christmas, and Happy Holidays to you all, and also Happy New Year in case if I don't see you before then. Uh, so next year might be the premiere of my new series, I don't know. Um, follow me at Twitter with the link in the description down below. And uh, be sure to let me know if you guys want me to do a end of the year DVD collection, which I will, you know, just go through. Maybe I'll have, like, on some, like, video game type music in the background while we do it. But, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Merry Christmas and happy holidays to you all. To my lovely girlfriend, thank you for being with me for all these fantastically four years. Thank you to all my friends who I've met, subscribers who stayed subscribed to me and been patient for me to upload. You guys are awesome. So Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays from all of us here at, at Leeds Universe. And uh, again, stay safe. It's the best thing that you can do. And uh, I'll see you guys probably next year. So until next year, you guys, I'm Leeds Universe signing out. And I'll see you next time.